welcome to my crib. Come on in. <laughs> so this is our Airbnb that we are currently staying in. It's super nice. We spent a lot of money on it and it's just absolutely amazing. So if you just want to follow me, I can like go around and kind of show you what's going on. So we'll start with the upstairs first. So first you will walk up these really dirty carpets, but it's fine because like the dirtier, the better. Okay, so this is the room that I'm staying in. I'm sharing a room with a few of my YouTube friends. And as you notice, this door has a nice stain of like some brown stuff. I don't know what they were really going for, but I absolutely love it. I'm living for it. So come on into my room. So it's kind of messy, but um, yeah, so this is our room. Um, I'll show you the closet. So once again, we have that classic brown stained door. So if you want to come on in, you can see that they even left us roach killer and disinfectant wipes and ant spray. Because, you know, when we see a roach crawling around, we can just, like, spray it and we'll be good to go. So that's awesome. And then if you come in here to the bathroom, yes, we have our own bathroom in our room. You'll come in and you can see that there is a really dirty mirror. But, I mean, we're all dirty animals, so it's fine. It's cool. And then if you come over to the shower, it looks pretty nice, but when you're showering, the water kind of like fills up and gets clogged. So you kind of get like a bath and a shower in one. So it's like more for your money, right? Oh, and there's no toilet paper. I love it. I mean, I get it. Like you want to be like environmentally friendly, right? Yeah. <laughs> so if you come over here, so I would show you underneath the bed, but I'm pretty sure there's actual living monsters down there. So, you know, we'll just give them their privacy and we'll go to the next room. Make sure there's nothing like on the Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hi, yeah. hi, So this is the honeymoon suite. Um, I'm not staying in here, um, Cam is. So we're just gonna like go in and show them everything. My favorite part about this room is the bed because it's super big, it's nice, and it's hard as a rock. So if you're like trying to get some sleep, but also like a little ab workout, it's perfect. So yeah. a one light moody setting which I totally like vibe with um, it's really like going for that once again brown stained up style so um, yeah they clearly know what they're doing so next room oh this is the living area quarters I don't know we have a TV that doesn't work love that I know they're just like trying to look out for us keep us from like being distracted and then you like you have this beautiful table with a nice centerpiece and it's nicely stained with fingerprints so like classic okay, let's keep going. Um, so next we're going to go into the kitchen love this chair just classic like you know you know it happens whatever I'm washing my hydro flask with bottled water because this water is disgusting yeah, so we love good soap. Okay, so anyways, we have some drawers. That one was the um, old mushroom. So we have some nice old mushrooms that have been growing in here, which is good because if we need some extra vegetables, we can incorporate that into some recipes. Really okay, great. No, also. no, no, no. This is very broken right here also. And then over here we have this nice island with these I don't really know what look they were going for, but it's like really bougie. I love the tape. Like they tried to put it back up, but um, it didn't work. And they just were like, this is a look. So let's keep going. We love flex tape. Now this is my favorite room. It's actually probably the nicest. Um, I don't know why we're not chilling in this room, but um, yeah, so all these doors are open and broken. Um, for the most part, so that's great. But um, yeah, let's keep moving. 
So I will take you to our backyard. This is our pool where we can just hang out and chill and it's really nice and awesome. So if you like want to take a swim, you can go in this murky water. I think they were kind of trying to go for like that swamp vibe, um, you know, just a little of, you know, something, something. And then over here we have a pool that I think is dirty, but I can't really tell because obviously my expectations are pretty low. He even left us a floaty that isn't blown up because, you know, we got to get an exercise and uh, get that started. But yeah, so. Other cleaning supplies. For real? Yeah, it's under the sink. Awesome. It's like spray Clorox. They leave us their cleaning supplies so we can clean everything ourselves. She got like 17 swimmers. What the hell is 17. this? This is our laundry room. Um, as you can see, there's dirty towels everywhere. Um, also, I had, to, I had to do the laundry from Oh, and when we showed up, there was dirty laundry. So, you know, extra clothes. Fine, it's cool. Now, if you come back here, there's another really awesome, beautiful room. There's this nice island that is also brown and stained. You know, they're going for that extra something, something. And I love this right here. Beautiful, definitely $4,000 worth of my money has gone into this house, and I love it. Best $4,000 I have ever spent. Anyways, let's keep going. Here, there's this mirror and it has a bunch of random stuff just shoved in there. We love that. Also, this used to be like an entrance, but they decided instead of letting people come through this, they're just going to block it off with this nice giant piece of boarding. We have a nice dishwasher, and if you open it, cockroaches will actually come out and just say, hey, how's it going? It's nice having like extra company live with us when you just, you know, need to do your dishes and have a little talk with some insects, you know, just like princesses do. Anyways, thank you for coming to my house tour. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Like I said, I highly, highly recommend this Airbnb if you just really want to cozy, clean, family friendly environment this is the place to be anyways i will see you guys next time bye okay guys so real talk obviously this was like a fun video but basically when we booked this airbnb we all pitched in and paid for it and it was like advertised online and it looked really good um it was the only one left that was ready to book that had enough rooms for all of us to stay in but when we showed up it was just absolutely filthy no one had cleaned it it's um it's disgusting and we've done our best to clean up as much as we can because like obviously we have children here and stuff and we're doing our best to get refunded but the lady has really made no progress at all and so we're trying to find like another place to stay because you know we shouldn't have to stay here in this <laughs> environment but it's just really i don't know it's really frustrating because I don't know, Airbnb, I thought, had better precautions with, like, stuff like this. So be careful when you book, and hopefully we get refunded, we get a new place. I don't know. Anyways, Ryla is literally, every time I speak, she's trying to distract me. So I'm sorry if, like, she's in the background, but it's super cute. But, yeah, so if you guys could do me a favor and just share this video so people know that this is not okay. And I will put the listing in the description box below so, like, people can spread the word and basically don't book here because I don't want someone else to have to go through what we are going through and um, it's not okay. This is not okay for Airbnb. This should not be allowed and um, it's very frustrating. So, you know, share this video, educate people and yeah, because I'm afraid someone else is going to stay here and waste their money and stuff and this is not okay. So, I don't know. Hopefully it gets resolved. Um, I'll probably do an update video and I know some of the other girls are filming videos about it as well and I'll put all their channel links in the description box below. Definitely check them out. Subscribe. But yeah, I'm going to get off of here and um, hope that I don't die in this house in the meantime.